The GAA, LGFA and Camogie Association have their roots in every community, providing lifelong experiences for all through a positive and enriching playing environment, whereby participants are supported in their developmental journey. To support the players on their journey, for the first time, all three associations have joined forces to develop a new player pathway framework. The pathway is aligned to our core values and is underpinned by six guiding principles. Club is core, player centered, quality coaching experiences, as many as possible for as long as possible, connection and inclusive. The player pathway framework consists of three phases, foundation, talent and elite high performance. The purpose of which is to develop players holistically as players and people by providing them with the right support at the right time to ensure they are equipped with the knowledge and skills to reach their potential, whatever that might be. Starting with the foundation phase or participation phase where the majority of our players participate in the community. The club is the central component of this phase. This phase is divided into three stages, with the first focusing on physical literacy, helping children to acquire and learn basic sporting movements and having fun through their involvement in club nurseries and school activities. In the next stage, children are exposed to the further development of functional movement skills and the early acquisition of the specific skills necessary to play our games. Here children are introduced to low level competition, such as our Go Games model. Acquiring these skills will help participants remain involved in sport and physical activity for life. At the third stage, Foundation 3, players engage in sports specific training and competition, demonstrating a real commitment to Gaelic games, as well as a sense of belonging to one's club and the Gaelic games family. It is important at this stage we provide players with positive experiences so that they are retained as lifelong participants by providing opportunities through our social and adapted games as well as more traditional competition. These experiences must centre around quality coaching and appropriate game opportunities. Here the club player strives for continuous improvement in order to reach their potential. In the F3 stage, some players who demonstrate that potential may be invited to experience the talent phase of development. This phase is an add-on experience to club-based activities at F3. T1 is the entry point for players who demonstrate potential to be classified as talented at a later point in their journey. Exposing as many players as possible to practices at this stage will assist the verification potential to move to the next stage, T2, where the player is given the opportunity to demonstrate their coachability, commitment and their motivation to fulfil their potential. In talent stage, T3, the focus turns to continuous performance, improvement and involves representation on senior school teams and inter-county underage teams. The final talent stage, T4, is where the player is at the cusp of breaking through to adult inter-county level. Many of these players participate in third level competition and require individual support from club and college coaches, as well as contributions from high performance professionals. Finally, when players break through, they have reached the elite or high performance stage. This phase is characterized by a high performance training environment involving many individualized support services. Crucially, the integrity of our unique pathway is maintained with players continuing to transition between the club and adult inter-county stages. We believe that our player development framework is an exciting prospect for the Gaelic Games family that will have a lasting impact on the development of our youth. Most importantly, the framework allows us to visualise a new approach to player development. A vision that accounts for individuality and variance a vision that represents the realities of the developmental journey, a vision that has the end in mind. The endpoint crucially may not be on Jones's road, but for the majority, it may be within a club environment that supports, values and develops its people so that their engagement with Gaelic games is sustained for life.